Hello dear students today we are going to start a new chapter the name of the chapter is physical and chemical changes introduction change is a universal phenomenon almost all substances undergo change while some changes are easy to detect some are so small that they are difficult to identify These changes have been taking place around us continuously day and night ripening of fruits change of seasons flowering of plants cooking of food burning of fuels growth of plants and growth of animals the change can be natural and man made change slow and fast change periodic and non periodic change desirable and undesirable change small and large change reversible and irreversible change temporary and permanent change all these changes are exciting and each of them has a reason behind it since most of the changes are different in nature it is necessary to study them in detail slow and fast changes the changes that take longer time to complete are called slow changes they take hours days months or even years to occur examples are Rusting of iron Change of seasons Formation of curd from milk A child growing into an adult The changes that take place in a very short interval of time are called fast changes. The examples are bursting of firecrackers, switching on a fan cutting of an apple natural and man made changes some of the changes take place in nature by themselves which are called natural changes the examples of natural changes are growing of a tree earthquakes eruption of volcanoes
Any change that occurs due to the efforts of human beings is called man-made change. The examples are Cooking of food Making of jewellery from gold Periodic and non-periodic changes Changes that are repeated at regular intervals of time are called periodic changes. The examples are Change of day and night Change of seasons Changes that are not repeated at regular intervals are called non-periodic changes. They occur at any time. The examples are A person becoming sick Landslides Earthquakes Reversible and irreversible changes When a change in a substance can be reversed by changing the conditions, it is said to be a reversible change. The examples of reversible change are Ice melting into water at room temperature And on cooling it will again turn back into ice. If a substance cannot be brought back to its original state after a change, it is said to be an irreversible change. The examples are Burning of a piece of paper into ash Cooking of food Formation of curd from milk Today's homework Write Two examples for each of the following changes. Periodic, non-periodic, reversible, irreversible, slow and fast changes. Write the answers in your notebook.